worldminus1.net, Jekyll and Mr. Hyde, <laughs> one of the most contentiously debated as the worst games on NES, but Ryan it, says... It's not that bad. Ryan I, says I don't know why bad. there's so much hate. Angry Video Game Nerd said it's just the worst, and he well, no, actually, he said it's the best game ever made. He did uh, everything but on. punch his own balls with a mini baseball bat. <laughs> he was very angry. Right, but to Ryan's point, man, as a kid, a lot of games were frustrating, and frustration does not mean bad, but you get... Oh, no, this game was pretty bad, playing. but you, you have to understand how to play, like, how the game works and what, you, like, what the goal is. Yeah, I remember playing it, and I literally did not ever get off a screen that resembled this. So I did could you never rent it? it? All right, so here's how you play the game. See, you have a life bar on the top, which is your actual life meter. Like, if you lose that, you're dead. There's the meter on the bottom that says, I think it's an H, and then there's a J on the right side. H is for a hide and J is for Jekyll. Jekyll makes you Jekyll, right? You flip. Yeah, well, so when I get hit by, when I get hit by things, either one of three things will happen. One, nothing happens, which is what makes this game a, a treat. <laughs> Everything's <laughs> random. Um, two, you'll lose some of your hide meter. Or three, you'll lose your life meter and, you know, and you'll lose some hide meter. When you when you lose all your hide meter, you become hide, and you play a game which is the exact mirror of what stage he's on, but it's you go from right to left and you shoot stuff. Now, and can you go up and down on that sidewalk or? No, you're stuck where I'm at. Um, now, basically, the Jekyll and Hyde levels are completely independent from each other. Each per each character has six levels to get through to beat the game. Hi or Jekyll, you just go right and try to survive or whatever. So you jump over <clears> that weird thing, whatever that is. That's a kitty cat. <laughs> kitty cats are very dangerous. And that's a doggy. Doggies are very dangerous. And uh, what is the fireworks shit going on in the bottom of the screen? Yeah, what is up off? with that? Uh, it, it's a guy with the bomb. He he plays a bigger part later. Um, now what happens is now you're in a swamp. Now this was like Zelda. What's the pea soup? What the fuck? Oh, shit, I'm 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 like way behind, way behind you guys. Really? Ugh. You just walked past just a walked white church. Now you're in the graveyard. That's where we we're at. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Whatever. Doesn't really matter Is that anyway. Where we're at? <clears throat> okay, yeah. So yeah, you didn't notice the bird actually taking like, the like bird dog is pooping on you. <laughs> like actual like dog poops. <laughs> yeah, it's big. It's big poop. That's a lot of poop for a bird. That's like a huge, like Doberman poop coming out of a small bird. What the fuck? All right, so, it might um, be a vulture or something. You don't know. But yeah, all right, so the way the game is played is when you become Hyde, you play your levels. You start from level one, you go th through the levels. Now, if you, there's two ways to die as Hyde. If you die, I mean, you can die by getting hit too much, like there's enemies and stuff that can they hurt you. And if you get as far into the game as Jekyll, so if I turn into, just say I'm in the you know, beginning portion of the second stage right now, if I turned into Hyde and I beat the first level and I got to the same point that Jekyll is at with Hyde, then I just die automatically. The game kills you. Now, what? here's Wait, where the what? strategy You're, you're going to have to dumb that down. That is shade. some back to the future shit. Like, I, both of it, you can't occupy the same space and time. We're going to cut Pretty you much. open and some tinker with your ticker. Collapse on itself. Pretty much, and you just die. So, Are you getting you hit have, on purpose right now? Yes, yeah, right now I'm getting hit on purpose. I'm going to explain this. All right, so this is where the strategy of the game comes in. Now, all right, now knowing you know, that, you know, that, that information based on the game, you have to maneuver Hyde to basically become Jekyll just before you reach Jekyll, okay? So what? You'll, you, you, I, I, so you'll see this section right here, okay? So, see, this actually feels more like a game. You, you hold up and B to um, to shoot your little projectile. I haven't shot anything yet. I'm actually trying to survive as long as I can because in my mind, I, I know that as long as I don't basically, as long as I don't beat the second level, I'm I'm okay, you know, as far as like the game still continuing. Now Hyde's Hyde's levels don't scroll, but Jekyll's do. Uh, Je I so um, Jekyll's levels you control like 
the, the movement of the screen. The high levels, he moves by himself. Like, you're constantly moving. So, every time you kill an enemy, you see how the, like, the Jekyll meter or whatever is, like, getting filled up a little bit? Every, th every third enemy will fill up your meter a little bit. Once the meter's full, you become Jekyll again. You can continue walking to the right. Now, at this point, I want so to talk about the fact... don't want to kill enemies? What the uh, fuck? Well, right, right now, this is part of the strategy. I don't want to kill him because I know I know I mean I played this game a lot so I know where I am in relation in relation to Jekyll. You I'm did. At. So I got I a want, bunch of angry texts to prove so, it. So so I know I'm not in um, in danger of having the game kill me yet. I know I've I know for sure I've already beaten the first stage, right? Yeah. Right. So as, as long as I don't beat the first stage, and I turn back into Jekyll, I'll be fine. So the strategy like the the strategy of the game is to basically move along your path until you have to turn back into Jekyll to yes, avoid the coins. Did the coins do You're anything? Going or is as that far just... as you know you can go and then turn back and then progress a little bit more and then change back and go as far change... as you can go. Yeah. Now, every time you turn back into Jekyll from Hyde, you get 75% of your meter back. All right, so right now, like, so, so now I know I have to basically just get on the ball and just kill whatever I can to become Jekyll again, which is what I did there. So... Now, I became Jekyll again, so I know, in my mind, we're both on level two. Does that make sense? Right. All right, so now I'm running through. Now, I know that if I turn into Jekyll, or if I turn back into Hyde now, I might run the risk of messing things up and the game's over. Now, Hyde has no, or no, Jekyll. Jekyll's a professor, right? Yeah. He has no recourse for things, like, so, like, you just have to avoid. That's your only option. He has a cane that does nothing. Uh, it kills bees, I think. <laughs> but that's, that's it. So it's a good weapon. Yeah, oh, it's the greatest. All right, so um, and top oh, tier. Right, and this is for this is for anything anyone that's wanting to play the game. Um, animals don't take away your actual life bar. Okay, they only take away the meter, like the hide meter. The rocks sometimes the rocks are random based on how you get hit and stuff. And the bird poop, too. That only takes the hide meter away. It doesn't take any life away. That's really important when you get to the later on when you're trying to basically purposely get hit by stuff to uh, turn it into hide without losing any life. Because obviously you want to try to may have a full life bar as hide so you can last longer in like the so demon So the world. angry video game nerd was nowhere near your level of understanding of this fucking game. Well, he understood how to play it, but he just wasn't any good at it. So he's a fag. Eh, I mean, he, so he's Ryan a good said game he's a fag. I'm, uh, I'm going to email I mean, he, that you said he was a fag. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Well, I, I, I might have called him a bum, but that was... <laughs> yeah, he did call him a bum. <laughs> but that was because he, I mean, he didn't... I was trying to be funny. Game. God, that went over like a fucking lead balloon. Jesus fucking... Led Christ. Zeppelin, you moron. Yeah. Like a lead balloon. <laughs> Okay, so right, so now I know that it, um, I think I try to actually turn back into Jekyll like as soon as possible because we're both on the same level. I'm at the end of it and he's at the beginning. Right, if you get to the gate, you're fucked. Yeah, then I, I die. Like the game is just over. Like, you get struck by like seemingly random lightning, you just die. But now, as the monster, you can kill as much you as actually, you want. Yeah, as as the monster, you're actually playing a game. <laughs> <laughs> what like, the fuck is wrong with this game? Like like you're jumping, you're shooting stuff. They just like they should have made the... it straight though. If you're just like this kid playing was... this game and you don't know that well, touching you... yourself across parallel universes will end the game, you... you probably like die multiple times. Like, what the fuck? I'm at the end of the level. What happened? If they had made Wait. the whole game like this, it would have been one of those been gems. Good... It... it would have been one of those just gems. Yeah, like, super they, fun. They, 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 like, like the game's actually like it feels like a, it's a playable game. It's not great, but it's not bad. Actually, angry video game nerd. If they had like a map or something that would show you your current location and his location, uh, no, that's, no, that, 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 this would be that, awesome. That, no, that's too much hand holding. I don't like that. That's too much hand holding. See, I like hand holding. The eight bit was the, not a hand holding system. <laughs> on, on like, I mean, it really wasn't. No, it was like, like random every, guessing. Yeah. <laughs> you get what you fucking get. I'm like everything on the Xbox 360 now. You get maps and you get save states and you can save whenever you want. Yeah, that's yeah. A good oh, not game. only that, just the characters tell you what to do. 
oh, you're not <laughs> doing it? This is what you should do. Like, hey, man, what do I do here? And you got like a million people playing that you can like find you shit know, out. You know who set that president? Ocarina of Time set that president. If it wasn't in Nintendo Power, you didn't know it back in the Ocarina day. Ocarina of Time set the president. Because Mario 64 didn't, if you were on your own. You got to find those stars. Yeah. Uh, for, but Ocarina was like, oh, you having trouble? Well, maybe you should try this. All right, so I uh, uh, think about those bombs. Go the thing about the bombs in the game is like every level that get the progress, the fuse gets shorter. So you see in the first two levels, I was like, I was able to just run to the right past them, but now I can't. If I get hit by the bomb, I can lose like pretty much all my life in one hit. Sometimes it's random. That bomb so, is so sexy. I want to get hit by him. So um, the, there's a guy, with the, the kid with the slingshot, who's trying to ki- like, kill you. The guy that we mentioned, why is he trying to blow you up? Is now, there a reason? Just, yeah, I, 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 I don't I, like that doctor. I'm going to explode I, I, him with yeah, dynamite right now you're a for no reason whatsoever. Yeah, and street. everyone I hates you. To kill you. <laughs> everyone hates you. It's ridiculous. I, I said so, uh, the story of the game is Jekyll's actually gone his way to his wedding. <laughs> and this is happening. Um, uh, here's the bees. Okay, so yeah, um, the, the bees will only kill your hide meter, which is beneficial like to know that so 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 you know you're not taking any life damage um as you're you know I trying to be this guy with all this shit going on he's still got a girl he's just, and getting married he's just trucking along he's, he's chasing <laughs> pussy he's blowing uh, up on me and shit I, and I, I can't wait to finger that bitch i say i don't know who the bomb guy is but uh the guy with the kid with the slingshot is like uh, the wife's like he's jealous of him or something. That's why he's shooting him with the slingshot. Mm, delicious. Which I'm actually surprised. Hey, there's he had a, a um, Bruce Banner, Incredible Hulk, Doctor Jekyll, Mister Hyde smash off somehow. I was gonna say that's a lot of storyline for a game that has no storyline. Yeah. Um, <laughs> the coins I pick up, I use later on. I'll explain that when I get to it. So, but yeah, uh, th- only Jekyll picks time... up coins. I didn't see Hyde pick up any coins. <laughs> Right. Yeah, yeah, only Hyde picks them up. It's the little C's that pop up on the screen. Yeah, uh, I know that. So. Yeah, yeah, like nine of them a while ago. Yeah, yeah. So all you can do is jump. Yeah, all you, I mean, you can use your cane to hit bees sometimes, but, but even the bees the, move in like weird paths. So, like, right? they're not even guaranteed. Like, you're not even guaranteed to hit them. And they move in, like, just, you know, random patterns. Can you twirl your cane and sing Prom Night Dumpster Baby? <laughs> That bitch just whooped your ass. Yeah, what was no, up with it, that? I had butted her crotch, and she took me down to everything. So th- that's actually like... As women will do. Uh, I did that on purpose, because I want to become Hyde right now. I usually head butter in the crotch on purpose, too. but <laughs> It knocks yeah. you out. That stank. <laughs> <laughs> Wake up it's a couple of days while, later. So I can't remember, actually. Um... So yeah, so yeah, the, those C's that I'm picking up, uh, those are coins. Now you can actually pay that lady off if you have enough coins. I think she takes like eight coins or something. You pay her to hit her in the crotch. No, um, if like... you uh, if you if you run past her, she takes like eight coins and then she stops singing. Like the, the, her her like purpose in the story is her singing is so bad that it hurts you. Which is so why you're like, finishing World Two as him. Now you're on level three. Yeah, yeah. So, okay. so it's, yeah, yeah. So, and I'm at, um, that the singer is actually the end of the level. So I know I know that I just need to not become. Well, I know I need to beat you know become Jekyll again before the end of the stage. Right. I got you. Yeah, it's not that complex when you know what you're doing. Oh shit! Sorry. Out. Um, so, yeah. So I became in. You know, I, I I changed back into Jekyll as fast as I could just because I don't want to deal with being on the same stage as him. Right. So literally, let me ask you this: If you were to somehow good enough get all the way to the last level with him and then get hit, you'd have to make it all the way to the last level. All, with, you'd have to play through all six stages as Hyde without dying. Yeah, without dying. So that's why nobody could ever beat the game. Well, it's not really that. It's I mean, I, I beat the game when I played it. Yeah, but, uh, he's doing it level by level, though. It's a little easier. Yeah. To do it that way. Well, yeah. I mean, it, it, it's more you know, it's about maintenance and 
Just making sure you know where you, where you, it's just making sure we're making sure you know where both your characters are at. Right, because to his point, if he just played the level, he remembers it a little bit better, so he knows where he has to stop at. You guys yeah. want a party? All right, so this is the most annoying part of the game. All these people, when they run, they just why hit they you. Just, why are they just throwing shit at you? What the fuck? Because You're a doctor. A-holes. What did you ever do to them? I don't see. I don't know. This is what I don't understand. But um, this is the most annoying part of the game. Level four in this section. Because the people that they just randomly start running at you, and you can't really react to it. And see, if you jump, you're gonna get hit by the second one fucking running. So <sighs> it's just, oh, it's just hard. So this the is why everybody it's... hated this game. I'm just a prom night dumpster baby. Bye, bye. I got no mom or dad. Prom night dumpster baby. That's the story is yeah, long, but boy, it's, it's awfully, awfully sad. sad. And though I came from a hole, and though we came from a hole, I'm singing right from the soul. He's singing right from the soul. My fanny, fanny needs, needs a blanket and somebody to spank it. I miss my mom, but she's at the prom, so I'm a prom night dumpster baby. Prom night dumpster baby. Bum, 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 bum. And I'm taking a stroll. He's taking a stroll. 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 Ah, breaking up that 48 minutes. Yeah. All right, moving on. So uh, it's stuff that I wanted to talk about. The lady also saw you run into her and you didn't change. So did you pay her off? Yeah, see, I, I, w- I was going to talk about it, but we were dealing with some ridiculous music. Um, <laughs> so I was playing a goddamn song. Well, it doesn't make sense because I'm a grown man in this game. I'm not a baby. <laughs> <laughs> I will say this, though. The taking a stroll part does kind of make sense because that's what he's he doing. He is taking it's a stroll. <laughs> All right, so yeah, so yeah, I, I paid off. I oh, see, I just hit the, um, I hit the B. I killed it. Does that do anything? <laughs> All right, I'm not, now you're flipping. Was that on purpose? Okay. I assume. No, that wasn't. I'm actually trying. I was actually trying to get it further than that, but they get, that section is just hard because all the bees are they because they move in random like patterns, so it's hard to. There's so many of them, it's hard to dodge. And like my meter was so low, it was just impossible to dodge. So in in essence, it's two separate games. You're just overlap yeah. playing them at the same time. Yeah, except you're only you're only allowed to play part of the game if certain parameters are met. Right. So it's kind of like um, very 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 early on theoretically. Ocarina it's kind of like uh, it's <laughs> Zelda. It's got like a light world, dark world. It's just yeah, it's, it's a link to the past. <laughs> <laughs> This is the this is the, this is this is the conceptual father to link to the past. <laughs> you do hate that game. You have never said a good thing about Ocarina of Time. This game, I've never played it. What? Time is the best Zelda ever. Everyone says it. I've, Everybody I, I've, says that. I'm not gonna say I, I. I the only Zelda game I've ever beaten was uh, Zelda Two: The Adventures of Link. <laughs> you never beat the first one. No. Link to the Past Holy is fun, fuck, man. Do uh, I need to I, run through on the first one for this website? Oh, because everybody does it. Come on. What? Well, well, That's the, so oh, boring. Oh, I, I, this section right here. Okay, this part with the stairs. Go, go, go. It, if you just, if you just like let the game scroll you off that last step, you glitch into the bottom of the floor and your game's over. So you, um, you actually have to jump off that step. That's, That's something that nobody dangerous. knows. <laughs> now, since okay, the 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 meter for the. Uh, what is it just timed for the the monster no you have to um e- each enemy you kill depending on what enemy it is will give you a certain takes away portion of that like meat his pack. his anguish i guess i don't know well because it just seems like okay i understand exactly Cause, cause it's definitely not timed like you control exactly as how long you become hide well, yeah, like I see with your ho ho ho, I'm in a suit, ha ha ha, I'm special. Like I see that, but like when you're hiding, it just feels like yeah, but it, yeah, but, yeah, but see when I'm hiding, it doesn't change me. But it doesn't change me back randomly. The re- the way you 
change back is by killing enemies. I can choose not to kill enemies, and I'll be I'll be hide longer. And so it's just straight up strategy to like go half yeah. and half and half and to half. figure out yeah if you know, figure out how far you can go, and you know what enemies are coming up like because uh, uh, the little orbs that pop up in the hide stages they don't give you your meter back. So really, it's, what it's you're saying? It's only the little brain guys and I th- and like the little ghouls and stuff. It's not the the balls that fly in the air. And I'm way gonna make a big deal about this when I post this on World Menace One dot net. Because this isn't the because this is like the best game I've ever played. <laughs> I think I told Chris Mold that, and he got upset at me. He yelled at me. Well, no, just this is a, this is very been thought out and video yeah, it actually, game, this game is actually like pretty smart. Angry like video game nerd just didn't uh, get it. Earlier with the Zelda reference, I'm saying it's really thought out in terms of what they're trying to do. It's just they didn't give you all the tools you needed to explain it at the beginning. Well, no, because he likes, well, he's like Reddit. He's like, he likes you pick it up like Mario 2 and you get it instantly. Yeah. And then the little subtleties, the more you play, you kind of get them. Uh, Just to get started in this game, you have to understand yeah, what you're doing. I, I put uh, Mr. Gimmick on r slash gaming and they downvoted it immediately, even though it's the best NES game ever made. So I don't understand Reddit. They just like this packaged, perfect, mediocre Zelda well, Mario. The, I, I, the thing is, people people expect to be good at everything they do. Yeah. And if they're not immediately good, that means the game is bad. Which is bullshit. I can see that. And honestly, didn't, I think that's where that, Jekyll and Hyde uh, failed, was because everyone didn't know how to play. They didn't know what was going on. And, I mean, to be fair, I mean, I haven't read the manual, but I doubt it. A, any of this information that, that I know about the game. Explain exactly. Well, you, you, well, you have a very high level of understanding of video games. Just in general, like you, you have a very high IQ for that. Yeah. Uh, normal. Even now. Oh, nobody would. You're, get you're this a super now. duper nobody hipster. Nobody would like it. I can guarantee this game would completely flop. Oh, yeah, if you're fucking. Uh, I give blowjobs to uh, anybody that has an old Nintendo with a Zelda cart in it on Reddit. Uh, upvote, upvote. They they wouldn't understand this game. It's well beyond their understanding. Because right, but you're also faggots. dealing with a market. Um, Ninety percent of the people that are eight bit like players and stuff or used to be back in the day, not your regular. You know, like Ryan still plugging away at it now. They're going to tell you Mario Three was the best game ever on NES, and that's just well, you know why. Because no one played Mr. Gimmick. That's why. Right. That's gonna get, they're going to say Mario 3 was the most in-depth, most crafty game made. It was awesome. And that's as far as it goes. Only, only thing I actually bothered for our site to put on Reddit was Mr. Gimmick because I thought it was so fucking special. It was, it's the best game ever made. Got three yeah. down votes. And yeah, three people decided to take time out of their life for us to, down to, us. to click down. Like That's ridiculous to me. They're hacks, but they be a, but you you fucking uh, you make a little a link picture. hat. Yeah, your your wife knits you a little link hat, and it's fucking upvote city. They're they're fags. They're stupid. They don't under, They don't they don't understand games. They're what a bunch of hacks. They don't they're need a bunch to. of twenty it's a, somethings. It's a hipster community. That's what exactly. it is online. There's total hipsters. They're all twenty somethings. They don't fucking understand shit about video games. They don't. They're not. They didn't, they weren't there. They're fucking. They think. A Link to the Past on Super Nintendo is, like, retro as fuck. No, I, fuck. I've talked to people that say N64 is the oldest thing they've ever played. And that what? My- fact. No, he's right. Shane, he's right. Fuck, I guess I do got to look at the fact that I am in my 30s now. Shit. They're like, oh, my God, Mario 64, that's so retro. Yeah, yeah. fuck what you. What are you talking about? Faggot. Mario 64 is in 3D, man. Yeah, exactly, <laughs> faggot. <laughs> what? talking about uh, <laughs> i remember see, the original you, promo you on see, Instant, but to your home system in 1994 no, they're the worst they're the worst yeah but um but i mean like i said i don't think this game is as bad as everyone says it is i really don't no that's what i'm saying it's very thought out now it's not as thought out as mr gimmick with the projectile being like well, now, pure here's the thing with mr gimmick it's thought out well, but the thing fun. is I, I i so like the, the angry video game nerd he acts like his last little synopsis of this game it actually makes a lot of sense they're using the he victorian era minutes. yeah they're using the victorian era as this like model of like society like you know fancy society with inward lust 
and they don't want to reward you for bad behavior, which is why your cane doesn't work. Now, when you're hide, you can go ape shit and you become Jekyll again. But they don't want to reward Jekyll being the good guy by giving him an act, uh, an active weapon to hurt people. <laughs> this is some fucking Dracula sexual type shit. That's why it only hurts the bees. I can see that. That makes Lucy, sense. Lucy, when she got bit, was experiencing her sexuality. Ooh. Yeah, she, like stuff like that. It's just like, you know, when you're high, you know, you feel good because you want to shoot stuff and you want to just cause mayhem. <laughs> Which I because, love. That's cool. Because because you're playing the game as Jekyll being basically handcuffed the entire time you're playing. So when yeah, you come by, though, I mean, let's think about it. So essentially, this is really the whole plot. game is a complicated ready, literary yeah. reference. You know, you're li- you're living the dream. You're you're you know upstanding guy. He's got birds dropping five pound shits on him. <laughs> Yeah, but I mean, it's just like like that constant. Like, you can and you can even see a lot of times too. Like when I start, w- once you be playing as Jekyll, once you become Hyde, you start just jumping and hitting buttons for no reason because you can do that now. <laughs> you could, you can't do that as Jekyll because if you jump, it takes you forever to start walking again. So for all the shit that this game got, it's actually not bad. I'm, I'm I got to send the beginning um, video, and like I said, unrealized I, yeah. brilliance. Dare I say it? <laughs> No. Now, okay. Very, very like greatest. Well, I, I've never actually played it, so I don't know uh, how the gameplay is. How's how's the gameplay? It's well, let's go nitty. It's awful. Yeah. Sure. As what Jekyll, about when you're Jekyll? It's unplayable. As right high and high. It's actually fun. So basically, it's thought out chaos. Yeah. Well, I'm, I'm like, it's, uh, it's just, I think I'm the only person that thinks that this game doesn't stink. I'm not saying it stinks. I'm not. You know what though? It. As we watch it and as you explain it, I it, get it. You, you I, I get sort of, what they're doing. You have a different thought about the game as a whole, like what you're doing. This makes me want to. Ask, it what the fuck it. is he throwing? Just like it, uh, it, it, it's called the psycho wave. Uh, that's what they call okay. it in the game. I don't know. Because it looks like the contra. Flame it's, it's actually it's on the cover too. If you look at the cover, it's like yeah, yeah. It says like play with the cycle, the wave. cycle wave. It's really yeah. fucking hilarious. Yeah. So no, the, I mean, the, the, the thing like, I, like he, I said, you know, I, I've said my piece about the game. Come up and cut your arm off. And I don't <laughs> think it's I don't think it's as bad as everyone says it is. 